Oh, when the sun beats down and burns the tar up on the roof, and your shoes get so hot, you wish your tired feet were fireproof. With my babies, where I'll be under the boardwalk. Check from Denver to Seaside during the early beginnings of the pandemic. The whole world just seems to be in a mess, but Florida's looking mighty appealing. <laughs> At this point, Claire is in Denver and they're shut down almost completely, and she decides to move into her parents' condo at Monterey. It was ideal. You know, she could work from, the, from there and from the beach and whatever else. And Claire heads down to the beach pretty much every day with her laptop and cell phone, and Jake can't help but notice that she needs to take a break. Jake started saying, hey, you want to want to have a beer? And uh, Claire's like, no, 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 no. I've, I've got to work. I got to back. <laughs> After a few light exchanges and beer offerings, he goes in for the kill. <laughs> hey, I saw some manatees out in the water. You want to take my sailboat out there and check them out? <laughs> it's a classic line used by so many of us, but perfected, <laughs> perfected by Mr. Williams. He was doing all the right things, and I wasn't even sure that he knew it. People walking above We'll be making love Under the boardwalk Boardwalk No matter where she went, she was having a lovely time. Every conversation had that tone to it. This tone in the back of, of uh, the conversation. It was a sense of craving home until 2020. I get a phone call. She's like, I just went on a date. The tone changed that day. And over the next year, that tone continued to change. It was at that moment, Jake, that I realized that she had found her home. Under the boardwalk, out of the sun. Under the boardwalk, we'll be having some fun. Under the boardwalk, people walking above. Under the boardwalk, we'll be falling. And she calls me one day and she's just giddy with excitement about this guy. And she'd been on the best date of her life. And she went on a like catamaran and there were dolphins jumping and there was like the sunset. Somewhere beyond the sea. Love at first sight. It took about five minutes. So everyone here has their COVID story, and I'm sure they're juicy, but I dare you to top that one. Somewhere watching for me. If I could fly like birds out. Are you hearing me? can't hide it. And when you're not, you can't fake it. Beyond the dark, my heart will lead me there soon. You got salty tears. <laughs> you literally took my breath away. <laughs> it's good. You ready to do this? Yeah. Me too. <laughs> I'm so ready. <laughs> Never been more ready. <laughs> Jake has always been there for me, and I, I think there's probably multiple people in this room that can say the exact same thing. Everybody else seeing the light that he has and how much he uplifts everybody around him. <laughs> those, uh, those onions, y'all. Um. <laughs> He's so vulnerable and so kind, and like you can't fake that level of like kind-heartedness. And it was one of those things that um, he was immediately a person that I knew would make the ordinary extraordinary. Beyond the sea, somewhere watching for.
for me. I will start by saying that Claire is an extraordinary woman. And I could see in your eyes, I could see in your face that you were starting to see the same things that I saw in her. And that's what you did for me. You are my home, Claire. You're my life coach. Woo. And my best friend. And I can't think of a better role model. <laughs> You're always there to give advice when I need support, and we won't let each other sink. Um, they both have the biggest hearts, and they're so kind and sweet, and they just, they're sunshine everywhere they go. He's always been my sunshine boy, and now I have a sunshine girl. Mahalo is a very special member of the family. He was adopted by Claire and Jake uh, during Hurricane Sandy, and he already had his name. Mahalo fittingly means to express gratitude. We're all gonna raise our glasses, and we're not gonna say cheers. We're gonna express gratitude for the love and happiness that Claire and Jake share with Mahalo. And so as you raise your glasses, you know what we're gonna say, right? Present to you for the first time, Claire and Jake Williams. 